There's good news this July 4th about the power of music and how one artist is telling the story of her America through one of our nation's most popular patriotic songs. It's one of our nation's most iconic patriotic songs. America the Beautiful, reimagined. Just saying, America the Beautiful, just mm, makes me cry. This song, so special for professional pianist Min Kwan, who moved to the U.S. from South Korea at just 13 years old. It's just really beautiful sentiment, and I think that's why <laughs> so many of us for generations, you know, uh, families from all over the world come here to, to make a new life. But at the height of the pandemic, and during a time of racial reckoning, Kwan saw this country becoming deeply divided. And she worried about the future for her two young daughters. When there was so much chaos, confusion, destruction, and literally death, I wanted to bring a new energy, new life, new force, uh, something positive. So she called on more than 70 composers for her project called America Beautiful, creating different versions to fit the many moods of America. This is our chance to come together and to show that, that diversity is something to celebrate. She's been performing them all across our nation, from fields to coastlines, even an underground cemetery. At Grace Church in Newark, New Jersey, where the song was first composed, Trevor Weston is creating a version based on his love of jazz. What did you think about joining this project? I look forward to kind of celebrating this melody that I thought was a beautiful melody and also her idea of kind of representing America and what makes it beautiful. Beautiful music Min hopes will bring us all closer together. Music teaches us the greatest lesson because you have to listen first in order to understand the language of someone else, you know, and we become stronger when we listen because that's the first step and then you create harmony. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.